I decided to get a coach for MLB The Show. I got the number one player in the world to coach me. There's only human beings on planet Earth at a very small limit amount that can do things like this individual can do. So what I did is I went into a practice mode and I asked him very important questions that only he can answer. Can I possibly become better at this game with tips from the actual greatest player ever possibly? This man has won three separate MLB The Show tournaments so there's probably nobody better to ask. Will this actually work or will I just never Ever, ever become more talented at this game. We will find out. Let's see what he has to say. What's up? What's going on, man? Uh, nothing much. I haven't really been playing lately, but... So you don't play much, you, you, and you still can just jump on and kick everyone's ass. What are the tournament's difficulties? Yeah, like, they've made... The I'm not aware of this. Of ...tournament, like, Thursday at 1 p.m. Like, I had to, like, leave college and, like, ske uh, reschedule classes and all of that, so it's just playing it. Do they think motherfuckers can just get up and leave at whatever? They can't do it on like a Friday night at 8 o'clock or something. I know there's there's like a thing where you just, you get good because you just play the game for a long time, but then it's also like what, what the hell is in your brain when you play this game? Like for example, let's paint the picture. You're in like the championship game with a shitload of money on the line or something. Like are you scared to death or are you like, no, let's do, let's kick this guy's ass. So that's a good question so an mlb 19 when i first started playing i was like a nervous wreck and i was i, I the amount of first round uh tournament exits i had to players i just not even like in a cocky way i just knew i was way better than and i just i, I got so stressed about it and it's just and then one tournament 21 i just said i don't care anymore i'm just gonna blast music and just play and i won uh the, that tournament so so what do you do in the game that makes you so damn good like how are you able to take the best pitches ever and then hit everything well um i would say the biggest i'm in a practice is... mode right now trying to hit so i'm just i'm listening and i'm taking the advice basically so 120 hertz monitor definitely helps um the biggest I thing is it. i start my pci um where the pitcher releases so for example if it's ronald acuna uh up to bat and i don't know adam wainwright pitching i start my pci low and in low and in if it's a righty versus a lefty pitcher i start a low and away uh righty pitcher with a lefty hitter i'm low and away so i just start like where they release it low and adjust from there i know you know it's how do you how do you able to take the best you, you, is it like is that a monitor thing too you just nothing bad is swung at and shit to be honest i think it's my age and just reaction time but playing so many games like over the years on legend kind of know where the pitch is going like i've seen the same pitcher pitchers don't really change that much over the years in my memory like if it's a cutter outside i usually lay off and my biggest thing if i don't like a pitch i'm not swinging you might have realized i don't really swing at like dots not worth it to me early in counts so you basically look for mistakes only pretty much unless it's two strikes obviously but and then i kind of feel confident getting my pci to any pitch now so do you guess pitches um I not, not like I in the really game guess, just in your but I can brain usually um that's the biggest thing is there are so many people i including myself i pit i'm a terrible pitcher I have like a seven ERA, but the tendencies I can pick up like two innings or so. Pretty much every single person who I've played who is incredible at this game pretty much admits that pitching is impossible and just pretty much have to out hit everybody. Yeah, that's what I do. Like I've won games on Legend like 27, 26 before. It's just terrible. What the hell is happening? If I was in a game like that, I, st I wouldn't have made it through it. It's so hard to pitch. Like you can hit any pitch that's in the strike zone so so who's the who's the hardest pitcher in the game this is the most random answer ever but i would say um adam wainwright i cannot hit an adam Dude. wainwright card to save my life so for the pitching thing it might be impossible to locate but in terms of what pitchers you need to use yeah i like sinker cutter that's kind of been the meta for years now but if it's a good lefty like randy johnson doesn't have sinker or cutter but he's still very effective sinker or cutter is what you should look for first but there's some out Flyers. And is that why you use Greg Maddox? I wanted to ask you that too. Yeah, I love I love guys that can look or half locate with. Do you think velocity matters? I'm trying to think of a car. Like Kershaw's like curveballs like 70 miles per hour. Like I just like 
hard to have speed differential. Like if this guy throws like 95 and 98, not worth it. So basically for hitting, it, it's, it's, it's basically just like you need to be able to, you need just to be, play the game for a while and get good at it, basically. This, is, and this might make you feel bad, but like I just kind of got a monitor in MLB 19 and it was like top five on the leaderboard a month away. I don't know how it happened. I had no clue I was even good at the game, but. So is that, is that that much of a difference? Yeah, if you're on Like the monitor, 120 hertz? Oh, it's night and day, I promise you. Yeah, it's like, at first on all my like top players, like when they tell me that, like I'm like, yeah, whatever. Can't be that big of a difference. And then I changed and uh, it was unbelievable. Is it just me or does 23 run like shit most of the time? Or do I, you not notice that because you have a good honest, monitor? I've I uh, thought that too. It, it, just it runs like tough. way worse than like previous 21 or something may have been ran way better. Who has the best swings in the game? Righties and lefty or go righties first and then lefties maybe because that, that that's a big thing, isn't it? Um, I love Acuna's swing. I think Trout has the best swing in the game. Though. Ronald's insane, dude. Even yeah. I'm good with Ronald. Vlad has a good one. Do you think Vlad Jr.? No, I hate Vlad's swing. I've never liked it. Son of a bitch. You didn't like the 99 Vlad in 21. No, I didn't. The home run derby one, no. Or was it the card that was released? Bryce Harper this year is my favorite lefty swim. I really value defense on my team. I swear I've made Man, thank you for saying that. I'm a yeah, some I say fielding is important and stuff, but then if they release some first base doesn't even matter, does it? Like yeah, that, is no. that can we just bury the myth? This is a meme on your channel for years, but my favorite reliever this year has been Aaron Loop. Is no way. Hitting and stuff seems to be. I mean, pitching is just a lost cause at this point. I mean, it would pretty much just been debunked if you admitted that. It's just something I might not be the best at, and I don't know if I'll be ever. You do practice mode before you play, or you just jump on and play? No, I don't. I just. I probably should, but I just get on, usually stream and play. Like, that's usually how my routine was like last year. <laughs> How often do you stream? So my semester ends like a month after uh, the game comes out probably. So I'll try to stream like every weekday, but that's usually hit or miss. It just depends. All right, man. Well, to be honest, that might be it. I don't know if there's really anything else I need to ask you. You pretty much gave me the lowdown of everything that a smart, intelligent person knows about this game who's actually good. How many tournaments you win? Three. Yeah. Yeah, three. Mother of shit. One. After I took the very important tips from the greatest player in MLB The Show, I assembled this team. I followed the tips very carefully for what he said. Mike Trout was his right-handed batter of choice for somebody who possibly had the best swing. Ronald was also one of his choices for best swings for a righty. He said Bellinger was good. He said Trey Turner was good. He even said Ricky Henderson was very good. He did not like Vlad though. That's weird. I am using Greg Maddox on the mound. This is exactly who he used against me when I played him because he was saying he likes people who can locate. This is the man who will hopefully bring me to the promised land because even he was saying pitching is almost a lost cause. So what does that say? I'm going into rank seasons with high hopes because something that was also mentioned that I very much lack is confidence. I'm going into this with high confidence today because if I don't, then it doesn't mean anything that was told to me regarding anything else does not matter. If you don't have confidence, if this does not work, then I don't know what to say. It's going to have to work, actually. I am not facing a team that is so scary, it's making me shit my pants. It's nice to see that for once. Oh no. This game needs to go well, alright? Confidence is at an all-time high right now. It's never been higher, actually. The tips were, you start at the side of the pitcher's throwing hand. You start a little bit low. You start low on the side where the ball releases, and then make your way to a spot where the ball lands. That probably would have been good to swing at. Move it, move it, and move it a little bit. Damn it, it may have worked. Actually, not damn it. Very good, damn it. What? Hit another one, then I actually think that I may have gotten better. If I hit another one, I actually will believe I got better. That was f***ing terrible. It was a triple, and I don't care. That didn't feel as bad as it did, actually. The tag, and he's out. But a run does come in. 
I am I'm not talented at this game. You just have to be talented. You have to just play this game enough that talent builds inside your body. It's not really anything you can train. There's specific tips that you can take, but I mean, you just gotta have it inside your body where you know you can do it. That's not helping the Vlad Jr. case. Absolutely shit on, destroyed, eliminated. I was told Marcus Simeon is a batter. Oops. I was told Simeon was a batter you want to use, and I'm out here batting under 200 with him, so that's probably not... That's fine though. That was, I want to see just the impact that that had on planet Earth. I guess the memo has not arrived at my house yet because apparently Ricky Henderson is good. I don't even think that was good. Here, let's test it. I want to see if I can throw something in a spot. No, I didn't want to throw that or whatever. If you locate this and I only use Greg Maddox the rest of the year, maybe. Next offering is in for a strike. Hey, let me try it again. Let me throw this one then and see if this works. Well, technically I missed that. Okay, this one. If I can't locate this one, then maybe. Mother of God, I found the pitcher of the year. This is the only person who takes the mound and locates. There's nothing that anyone can do about that. You could have had Pedro Martinez in his prime and that pitch is still getting destroyed. <sighs> All right, Mike Schmidt is up. Who the hell uses Mike Schmidt? If someone was telling me batting stances that you didn't want to use, then this is probably one of them. All right, I can't locate shit now. What's happening? That was, was, was still good. Abs, oh my. That's weird. Maybe this is something that is working here. I don't know if really tips that I've heard before have worked. This works? Maybe. Uh-oh. I guess that didn't end that terribly. Please tell me that was a mistake. If somebody leaves, then Greg Maddox is pitching with zero stamina. He probably locates better than every other pitcher with zero stamina. What? What did he do? He could have been out of the inning. People don't even need to be wearing pants and Mike Trout will cause people to shit them. I am not bullshitting. I feel like this is way better. He might be onto something. May have been a ground ball that just completely ruined the inning, but that somehow that makes me feel better than anything else would have happened, unless it was a home run. Shut up. Also, something that I feel like was a very underrated tip was defense. Oh my God, no. Defense, defense, defense is important after all. And I believe it. So if I didn't mention the defense before, that is what's taking place. I don't know if anyone besides Vlad has bad field and it doesn't matter because he's playing third base. This is going to be the signature Greg Maddox pitch. Holy shit. This is kind of sad that if you just locate a pitch in this game, it almost is the most surprising thing you've ever seen. I'm two innings into this and things have been going somewhat okay. Oh, this is really not helping the Vlad Jr. case. Okay. Why did that feel so shitty? This is... Why didn't he swing at that? my fault there's only four runs in this game and i still i feel good i, I don't know that's make making up my head or something but i don't feel that pathetic anymore i don't know if greg maddox can even not locate something if he tried to i don't know if it'd miss oh god this is just disgusting greg maddox is so confident right now he could race sea biscuit and win this is a display for the ages three innings into this 
Holy shit, I thought that was gone. Oh my god. Brings it in. What happened to this field? This was in ship it at one point almost. Into the outfield base hit. Yeah, it works. That's a hit you show to a high school team. That's so good. I don't see how in any possible way that Mike Trout does not hit a home run right now. The three two is off the outside edge. That's lame. This is a weird game because I feel like everything is going well and it's only four runs on the board. I don't know if Greg Maddox has given up another hit this game. I don't even know how he gave up one in the first place. The pitching in this is just un- oh no. And the fielding comes through. The speed, the fielding, the reaction. That saved a triple. What was that? What? Strike one. Rolled over to third. How many outs? I haven't. When was the last time a run was scored? It's weird. That is absolute. Oh, come on. That, don't give me another. If that's another almost warning track shot, that is three from Vlad. And Am I falling apart? Hmm. I just dove the f around and it worked. More rare to make a routine play than a damn diving catch anymore. This is f Look, uh, I meant to dive and it would have been made if I did. If that, that doesn't just show that this is one of the best damn pitchers in the game, then I don't know what does. That's two in a row, mother All right, that's not fair. You can't do that to somebody. I don't know if I'm getting worried, but I might be soon if I don't score a run or at least do something that's close to scoring one. It might land, and if it does, I don't see... Oh my Jesus Christ, he almost caught it. I didn't even feel good. I think everything might end now. And that should be extra bases. Flying around third is Turner. Of course. You go, you don't make it, you don't go, you look stupid. It's just a lose loose. Where's the home run, Trout? Give this guy credit for staying in a game that's 7 nothing in January. Not again. Absolutely no way. Vlad has probably hit almost a thousand feet worth of baseball distance and no home runs. I have never been more shocked I haven't seen a bunt yet. This is insane. Cody. Damn. Simeon? He could have dove and made that. If he dove, he would have made it. I think easily. See, that is just something that is never hit. It, it's like a pitch that's right there, but you always miss it because it's just so bad it's good. Holy shit, this might land. It is. Um, oh, it's foul. Oh! And he handles it himself. Really? Got him. Good job at damage control right there. I don't think that happened. You can pretty much put a bow tie on this game. This is fing over. This is like some best outing of all time type shit from what I'm seeing. This is this outing is so good you throw a curveball in the zone, it'll work. Well, if any pitch was risk of... What?
You know, I'm just surprised it lasted that long. All right, what do we learn? We learned that Greg Maddox is unbelievably elite. I also may have learned that everything that I was told may have also worked. Now do it consistently, and then I actually will think it worked. Wow, that's amazing. Look at that. Ugh. It's almost annoying unlocking packs at this point.